to me, in some ways, it's exciting to see where technology has gone in just the past few years alone, and the advancements in still staying small, not overheating, extending battery life, managing apps better, and producing audio and video fidelity that's beyond epic concert sound, and phones that can now shoot in red or above. Um, I'm shooting stuff in high red on my phones, um, 1900, um, 2000 or something like that, FHD or it's called. Um, but that'll bounce to IMAX or any other formats. Uh, the upside is bouncing quality is better. The problem is when you bounce the phone off the fucking sidewalk, it still screws up the lens and gives you all kinds of artifacts, as you see like that in the camera. Uh, or when you have, you know, somebody like last night a hit and run that plowed into me and slammed my um, bike frame against me and my phone and cracked the screen and screwed up this phone quite significantly, I might add. I'm pretty pissed. But um, whoever this hit and run bitch is, she is going to pay for it. We are offering an award for tips for her rest and conviction. Um, it was intentional, it was malicious, it was hateful and painful and it exacerbated other injuries I already have. There's like this new generation or new evolution of hate in haters that think it's okay to run people over on bikes in the street or scooters and laugh and then run away. Thanks for going Metro. Um, Your safety is our top priority. Whether the person you hit and run is homeless, rich, or otherwise, you have still committed a felony, dumbasses. Just a thought. And since I'm working on a concert for World Peace and Humanitarian Issues, you may have added a terrorist act to a war card. Better to turn yourself in now you get some leniency and have us catch up with you and bury you in the paperwork from hell in the federal penitentiary. Food for thought can you sure as hell know if you did hit it around me because some of you jackasses intentionally went out of your way. It was so obvious, like, you know, cutting across three lanes or hitting me with a double decker buckle bus when I had the other way in broad daylight, even when you're being waved off by NTA superheroes. I mean, come on. There's a difference between an accident. Sorry, after 24 hits and runs in uh, about 36 months, I'm pissed. But you know, that's just the hit and runs that just include the assaults and batteries, um, deadly force, attack with deadly weapons, uh, attempts to kill me on so many levels and less count. Let me just say this about all of that. The number of cash equipment from infinity to infinity, for the sins you've committed, you will pay. So it's better to do your amends now while you still can and make that fork in the path and change and you do. And work your ass off while there's still time left to help others and prevent. World War III. It is our professional opinion that no one wins World War III and that if you guys don't start this up soon, it's been a prolonged agony. We can help you to probably get it faster. Um, or, you know, let's find a way to coexist. I like that one better. And get over who's got the best gun, who's got the biggest ego, who's got the biggest whatever. Maybe it's only 1% to, you know, no one's like to live untitled for a couple of centuries so you jackasses stop being such self righteous, godlike pricks. Um, but those of you that are at the heart of this proposed genocide for the Georgia Guidestones are true hedonistic Satanist to the core. And I wish you the attorney you deserve in the great abyss. Rock and roll. Take a stand for world peace. Contact us at Disaster Relief and let us know how you can help rock the world to wake up in Extinction 7.